intolerance and bigotry take center stage at the Miami Theater Center in Miami Shores with the world premiere of the daring new play, Everybody Drinks the Same Water. This Jew seems to know a lot about poisoning. Perhaps your majesty should interrogate him. It's a story MTC's artistic director, Stephanie Anson, just had to tell. It's definitely political, it's emotional, it's about tolerance, it's about love, it's about looking inside yourself and seeing how tolerant you really are when, when circumstances are tense. And it does get tense. Set in 1236 in the city of Cordoba, Spain, home to Muslims, Christians, and Jews, when the city's main water supply becomes poisoned, the blame game between the people begins. What do they say about the poisoning? They're pointing fingers in every direction. The story is fiction, but the main characters are real and based on actual historical figures. After ending 500 years of Muslim rule, Cordoba's new Christian king is the first to be poisoned. But soon, the entire city falls victim and the medieval murder mystery begins. Suddenly, the Christian king is poisoned, and the queen immediately suspects the Muslims of retaliation. The Jews certainly could have predicted that response. Something happened in Cordoba uh, at that time that we need to look at it. We need to go back and, and see uh, what we can learn. One. Two, three! The Christian prince, a young Jewish midwife, and a Muslim girl then look beyond their differences and join forces to try and solve the mystery. Look over there! See that stone structure? I think that's the beginning of the aqueduct. Fatima, it is! Our main goal is to find out what's happening, what's going on, and uh, yeah, we get a little distracted at times, but we, nev we never... You never lose focus. never lose focus. No, you don't. And in the end, the theme of the play goes way beyond tolerance and acceptance. And the real killer is at last exposed. Visually, they're going to be just blown away from it. And it's a great story here. And it's a story for everybody. And the fact that we're going to be able to get a conversation going with young people is going to be wonderful. We all drink the same water. We all tell the same stories. Yeah.